If it weren't for tool and die makers, there would be no manufactured goods. That's because there'd be no one to make the molds that shape the plastic, or the tools that make other tools, or the dies used to stamp out parts. Tool and die makers decide on the best way to shape a piece of metal to the specifications of an engineer's blueprint. They operate many different machines to cut, bore, mill, grind, and polish the finished piece to a precision 40 times smaller than a human hair. Typically, one worker creates a single device from start to finish. That requires the ability to work without close supervision. It also requires a broader knowledge of mathematics and metals than most machinists need. Increasingly, it also requires skill with computer-aided design software and the computer numerically controlled machines that automate many processes. But whether they're using a state-of-the-art computer or a 50-year-old metal lathe, tool and die makers have the satisfaction of creating something that would never exist were it not for their skills. And those skills will always be in demand.